And we have an update to breaking news. We first brought you this morning. Memphis police are making headway in their investigation of the deadly shooting at Privé, where seven people were shot and two were killed. So our Quimitra Wilborn joins us now live this evening following a press conference hosted by MPD. And Quimitra, what have you learned? Well, Greg, we spoke to Memphis police officers just moments ago, and we've learned quite a bit of information. But the biggest detail is that we've learned the two deceased victims, according to Memphis police, were targeted in this shooting. And the other five victims, Memphis police say they were all innocent bystanders. So here's what Memphis police say happened. They say there was a fight that started inside of the restaurant shortly before 1130 last night. They say that fight then came carried over into the parking lot, and that's when shots were fired. Memphis police found two gunshot victims at the scene. One died on the scene and the other died at the hospital. Again, those are the two men that Memphis police say were targeted in this shooting. From there, they say five other gunshot victims arrived at the hospital via private vehicle, and they tell us as of right now, all five of those victims are still in the hospital in critical condition. Now, Memphis police did not go into any any detail on what led to this altercation because they said this is still under investigation, but they tell us they have two suspects in custody. They say one of the suspects is charged or is facing a first degree murder charge and the other is facing a criminal attempt murder charge as well as aggravated robbery. Again, Memphis police, they released a lot of information, but they did not tell us the identity of the suspect. So we are expecting that information to be released sometime this evening later on on today again but again they say this is still an active investigation and they say they're actually still looking for suspects so they're really reaching out to the public they're asking the public if you were there if you know anything they're encouraging you to contact crime stoppers at 528 cash now we're going to hear more from memphis police later on today on wreg news at 10 so make sure to stay tuned in for those updates reporting live from downtown memphis Kimitra Wilborn, wreg news channel 3.